Hey guys, what's up? Kevin A.K. Keep it second. Shout out to Zero here, and welcome to another Crashing Racing Not Your Field video. Um, so, last time I rated all of the skins, every single one of them, and uh, that was definitely my longest video ever. So, um, yes, I know. I mean, there was there's a lot of skins, believe me, a lot. So, you can imagine how long that would have taken. Um, but unlike that one, uh, this next one here is going to be a lot shorter because um, I'm here to review every cart in the game. Uh, or bodies, if you will. I'm just going to call it carts. It really makes more sense. Um, so yeah, there's 39 of them. Which is way less than the number of skins that they were for each character. So, um... Yeah, just gonna review um, which uh, ones are my favorites, uh, which are like pretty much nine out of ten uh, cards. Like eight, eight of them are still very good to me. Seven, six are good; they're all right. Five is like average, and four or less I'm not really too pleased with, especially around two to one area. Um, but uh, let's get started, shall we? We will go with the classic first, right here. I, um, honestly, this is, like, the, my favorite basic cart in all cart racers. I think this looks very good. It's simple, but it works, you know? Like, I love the back, even. Love the pipes that go with it, the gold pipes. Or is that just, like, um, the color that goes with it, the blue one? Because the blue one's the basic one. Um, but I love this cart very much. I'm gonna give it a 9. It's so simple, but I still love it quite a lot. Uh, Team Bandicoot. Um, yeah, this one's like, I like the pipes that go with it. Platform that's in the back. The white space. Um, I used to play, like, Nash in this cart uh, for some reason. Um, I might still do, but now that the Velo Chopper is here, I might use that more. Because it fits it more. Or anything else in particular, but yeah, like I really do like this card a lot. I'm gonna give it an eight. I really like it. Team Trance, um, another one that I actually frequently use. I use it for characters like uh, Dingo Dial and um, who else is there? I think Ripperu even. Um, yeah, like quite a few. Well, that's the ones I remember, though. But I still really like it. I like the antenna that goes on with it. Little bug eyes. Nice back. I like the little gear that's going around there. Like, this is a really good card also. This is a 8 out of 10. I do enjoy it, and I don't think I'll stop using that card anytime soon. This one, however, 10 out of 10, the best card in the whole game, in my opinion. Just look at that. Those menacing teeth. Like, oh god, so good looking. Amazing. And look at the red light on top of it. The motor, like, oh jeez. Uh, this is definitely my main cart. Um, as you see in my walkthrough, I just wanted to get this cart only. I really couldn't care anything about less at that time. Like, I'll play any character with this cart. I don't care who. This is 10 out of 10. I love it. Love it so much. Best card in the game. Team Oxide. Another really good one. I love the uh, wings on the side there. Nice thing in the back of the truck. Like like the lights. Look at the good. It's a good like good looking car. Nice shape. Nice shape. Nice size. I'm gonna give that a nine. I really, really like this. I really dig it. Hovercraft. Um, I only use this card when I use when I play as Nitrous Oxide. I don't play Nitrous Oxide in any other card but this one. It just doesn't. It just doesn't feel the same without. Like, it's not Ox Nitrous Oxide without its Hovercraft. You know, I just don't feel like it. This doesn't feel right. But I still really love this um, cra craft. It looks great. I love the pipes that go with it. The search lights. Well, not search lights, just lights. I don't know what you call those. I'm sorry. Alright, 9 out of 10. 
I love this craft very much. Cabrillo, Cabrillo, I think that's how you pronounce it. It's a nice looking car. It's, um, looks like a stylish back in like the 70s or if you will, in the 60s. Like one of those classic bike, the like cars it looks like. I mean, that's how I see it. I mean, I could probably be wrong, which I mostly am. Nice little lights going on there. Nice little small exhaust pipes. It's nice. I'll, I'll give it a 7. It's good. Crikey. Crikey. Alright, that's not bad. Um... Of course, you have to have that that um, cushion there. Wouldn't be an Australian car if it didn't have that. Um, kind of like the gold uh, pipe for that. I'm gonna give this a seven. It's not bad. I like it. Detonator. Not bad. Like I use this car uh, when I play with Pinstripe. Um, because it looks very, like, casino-ish, like, something where you ride to, to casinos, like, if you're, like, really fancy and if you're, like, super rich, you can, like, drive this thing. I really like this car. I'm gonna give it a 9. I really dig it. And it's got a little trunk, too. That's neat. You can put, like, your money on it. The money inside it, because it's so rich. Yeah, 9 out of 10. I love. I really love that car there. Uh, Doom Buggy. Um, I think this is one... I like the glass there. That uh, they're showing. So I'm kind of right in there, just in case. Um, Alright, well, the back is a little weird, but I'm not going to, like devalue it, really. I'm just, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give it a 7. I think it looks pretty good. Uh, Imperium. Alright, so, they did a lot, like, they put a lot of platforms here. Um, it's kind of big in the back, though. Uh, I mean, it's not, it doesn't look so bad, though. I'm gonna give this a 7. Make it easy. It would have been an 8 if it was a little, like, um, smaller in the back. Uh, oh, those bars, um... How come they have metal bars on the right side? That's weird. I didn't even notice that. Yeah, I'll still give it a 7, though. Those metal bars have to go, though. Roadster. Um, well, this, is a, this is a good one. Little, little lights that look like eyes and that looks like a mouth here. Got a little trunk. Uh, I'll give this, um... I'll give it a 7. I don't think it's bad. I don't think it's bad at all, so... That looks pretty good. I don't know if I'll ever use this, though, but... It's de there's definitely worse cars than this, for sure. Like, this isn't even bad. This is, like... Not feeling too much. But it might be something I might pick up in the future. Yeah, I'm gonna have a 7 out of 10 now. 6 pipe. Six pipes, alright. So, um... This is another classic looking cart here. Got a little trunk. Got a little handle for it. Uh... Was this for the Halloween event? I don't even know. No, I don't think... No, no, it wasn't. It wasn't. The Skull Rider was, and, um... That... The piano one was. And the one with the... With the diver's helmet on? Those are the Halloween ones. I forgot which one is. Or is it just like just a normal one? I don't know, but either way, it looks fine. I'm gonna give it a seven. It's not bad. Let it pass. Tricky. Uh hmm. Another card that looks that has a face on it. I don't know, I don't know about the idea of having just three wheels though, that's kinda a little off. Um I would have liked it if um, the front had just one wheel too. It looked like a motorcycle. But um, I don't know. I think I'm gonna give this one a six, just because I don't know if it really doesn't go so well. I think it's, I'm the, I think the back wheel is really big. <laughs> but um, yeah, six out of ten. 
the chow. Um, I think the axe is silent, so I'm just gonna let chow. So, Alright, this is nice. I like the little, like, stripes on it. It's a cool looking car. Uh, I'm gonna give this a 7. I think it looks good. I don't know who to put this, uh, this, um, into. Like, what character to use for this card, but I think it's on Mel. Maybe I'll, maybe one day. I'll give, I'll give it a 7, though. I think it's good. Band Buggy. Uh, this one's fine, I guess. A little wheel in the back there. Uh, interesting front. Mm -hmm. I'll give this a six as well. I don't think it's bad, but it's something too special. Alright, Rocket. This is a little smaller than I thought it would be. Um, like the pipes though. Those things on the side are kind of weird, though. Uh, I'm going to give this one a 6, actually. I think the pipes are the best feature for it. Other than that, nothing too crazy. But not bad either, so 6 out of 10. Pro Bowl Lot 2000. Pro Bowl Lot 2000. Alright, you got a little monitor there. It's a hovercraft, honestly. like the exhaust pipes. The wheels are cool, like how they float like that. It's not bad. Uh, between a 7 or an 8, I'm going to give it. Um, I guess a 7. A 7 is fair. I do like it. If I was doing like .5s or anything, it would be like a 7.5 out of 5, but we're not doing that. Uh, Alright, so Mammoth. Got a little long cloth there. Got some bones. Nice use of horns. This doesn't seem so bad. Uh, I'm gonna get a seven. I kind of like it. I like the design of it, but it's not like breathtaking. It's still good for what it is. So yeah, seven for that one. Nostalginator. Alright, yeah, this is the eyelash one. Um, because it was the same one as uh, one of the other ones. I believe it was the Roadster. Oh, pretty. Um, I kind of use uh, Pasadena for uh, this kind of car. I like it. It's cute. It represents more girl power. And you can play any girl character in this car, whatever you want. I would give it a 7. I like it. Like, there we go with this. Dragonfly. Okay. So, oh, another uh, three-wheeler. All right. This one looks slightly cooler, though. I must say. Uh, like the design, with the yellow with it. Uh, I'll give it a seven. It's easier. I was thinking about giving it a six, but I'll give it a seven just for like the design right here. The Spiral Mobile. Oh, this is cool. I should never get to this fully see it much. That's not bad. I like the scales. It's like a dragon. This will represent that it's Spyro's car. Looks good. I'm going to give it an 8. 8 out of 10. I really like it. I like how razor sharp the edges are. Nasty ride. Oh, this is actually cool. I like the horns. On the back, the spikes on the sides. This is actually a really good car. I'm gonna give it an eight. I really enjoy it. I never played this car before, though. It looks really good. I might try it. Man, I'm gonna try it. All right, now to list. Um, I've only played this a few times when I was doing Komodo Mo. I was playing with Komodo Mo. Like I was trying to get all the skins. I mean, I don't know. I don't know about the... I mean, it would have worked. Like, the diver's helmet and the fish would have worked if this car was more... Like a water-type kind of car. This one's just like an old classic one. Like, uh, the detonator and, um... The 
Garbio. I don't know. I guess I'll. I guess I'll give it a seven. I'll be fair. Give it that a seven. I think it's fine. All right, Skull Rider. Um, I love how huge the teeth are. That mean look. Like the engines. This is definitely uh, one of the better ones. I'd say it's an 8 out of 10. I really like it. I think it's very menacing. And uh, I'll be looking forward to playing it with it some more. Phantom. This one I really like. I think that's really cool. Got piano in the back, or organs in the back. Very nice pipes, little candles going with it. This is really good. Should I give it 8 or 9, though? Because this is what they're up to. I guess I'll give it an 8. I'll de I'm definitely playing some more, but I wouldn't say it's like a 9, though, because it's like... I don't know, that's just me. But I still think it's a very good cart. And I'll definitely be spending time with it more. Like, anything that's 8, 9, or 10, I'll always play with. A uh, nitro bumper. So it's like a bumper car. And um, I love bumper cars. It's like the most fun thing to have, play around. Uh, uh, like now, now, now I'm thinking in Fun Time USA. Oh god, such good times. So fun that place. And I play bumper. One of, this bumper cars is one of the most uh, thing. Like the one of the games that I played the most. Just driving like through a bunch of like giant and jet. Um, Carts. I'm talking like football. Like there are a bunch of <laughs> a bunch of bumper cars of like giant and jet players, and we used to like ram each other with them. It's so good, so fun. I like this though. I'm gonna give it a seven, seven out of ten. Kind of weird background though. Front's good though. Yeah, I'm gonna give this a seven. Daredevil. Alright, that's not so bad. Kinda small, though, if you ask me. I like the front, though. That's okay. D&D? I don't know what that represents, but whatever. I'm gonna give this a 7. I think it's a good cart. Or maybe it's just the character I'm playing as, that's why it's so small, but I doubt it. I mean, I don't... I mean, cart size doesn't really matter in this game. Um, which is fantastic. Um, so 7 out of 10 for Daredevil, I like it. It's not bad. Pressurizer. Ooh, uh, wow. <laughs> I was not prepared for this. Um, it's kind of... I don't know, it's, I think it's too detailed, if you ask me. There's exhaust pipes, there's like... Oxygen fuel. Uh... I don't know. I don't, I think this is my least favorite one so far. I think I think maybe give this a five. I think it's average. It's not terrible though, but it's like I think it's kind of overdoing it. It's overdone. I think it's average at best. Snow plower. Um, I pretty much always use this one every time I play with uh, Yaya. Um, it's all right. It has a shovel like a snow plower. I mean, it is a snow plower. <laughs> What the hell am I doing? What am I saying? It is a snow plower. Um, it's like, except plowing um, other carts out of your way. But um, whatever, it's it's fine. I give it a six out of ten. I think it's okay. It's not bad. Um, again, like I said, I only really use this car when I play Yay Yay, which is the panda, the panda girl. Um, all right, moving on. Dusty Rider. Um, I like this card. I play this a lot with Mega Mix, obviously, because that is his card. I really like the glow. I like that glowing, um, light that's showing. The buzzsaw is really nice. Looks badass. I'm gonna give this an 8. I like this. I like this card. Desert Duster. So, this is another spacecraft. Nice little front. Decent uh, background. Uh, this one gets a seven, I'd say. Seven out of ten. It's not bad. Not bad. The nuke. 
Yeah, this card is this card looks awesome, honestly. This one has a little bit of spikes in the back. Very nice touch. One on the front too. The glowing red. Look at that, look at that, it's like ammo. And the on top of the car here. I don't know if you can see it move. Looks great. I'm gonna give this a nine. I really like this car. Uh what is it called? The new Yeah, very, very, very nice. Very nice car. Um, before we move on, just wanna... Okay. Just making sure. Alright, so we're almost there. We're almost done. Um, the new Velo Chopper. Um, I only use this car for when I play Velo. But, um, who knows? I might actually use it for other characters now. Because I really do like this car a lot. Craft a lot. Like the Nitro Card game, like Nitro Card has really good uh, cards actually. Like not one of them is like bad. And I think like Nitro Card is like very overlooked. It's very underrated, and it's slower. Yes, I agree. I still think the original is definitely better, but I still like Nitro Card a lot. I really do. And I think whenever I get a chance, I'll do a playthrough of it. But I have to get back to the game though. I mean, I, I, it's not coming anytime soon, but we'll see. I mean, I doubt it'll do any different. I mean, I doubt any of you will watch it now that this game's out. <laughs> but I still really like the game a lot. And I like this card a lot. This is a 9 out of 10. I love the we the fans that are going on in the front. Love the exhaust pie. It looks great. And the V for Velo, just making sure that it's his. Looks great. I love it. Galactic Cruiser. Um, this is nice. I like the light going down below. Nice little electric motors there. Um, I'm going to give this a 7. I like it. It's not bad. It's not the best overcraft ever, but still not bad. I think the color looks better in the portrait, though, than what I have now, though. Let's see. Okay, here are the cards that I don't have. Just four of them. Champion, which I'll never, ever get. That's really cool looking. I like the red light in the back. Nice front. It's nice. If I had it, I would give it an 8 out of 10. I think it's a very nice, stylish car. It's really good. Nitro Slay. Um, it's alright. I mean, it's a Christmas themed uh, car. There's a little reindeer in front. That's cute. It's just pretty much a sleigh. Nothing else to say. But it, like, hovers. It's, it's neat. I'm going to give it a 7. It's not bad. I like it. I don't know if I'll ever use it soon. Uh, oh god. Candy cone. Yeesh. Oh god, it blinks! What the hell? That's so creepy. Um, alright. And it has a little, like, tail. And it's like a rip. Oh god, that is so weird. I don't know. I don't know if I want that. I'm gonna have to give that. <laughs> I'm gonna have to give that a four. That's too creepy for me. I don't know if I can even put it as average. This is the worst card ever. <laughs> but I'll give it a four though, just for like creativity and that, and like for freaking out people. All right, last card, Void Manta. Um, all right, that's not so bad, I guess. Okay, um, weird little front. Right. Um, I'm gonna give it a six. I think six is fair. I mean, it's not too captivating, but it's fine for what it is. So, I'll let that pass. Alright, so that's it for the carts. So, yeah, not a lot. So, this is way shorter than it was back then, than the first one. So, um, best cards are. Oh, actually, no, wait. There is more. Um, special cards. Here's the classic ones, the retro ones. So, this is pretty much from the first game, the original game. Um, nothing else to say, it's just like the PS1 one, but it still is just as good as the classic one that we have now. So, I'm gonna give it a 9 out of 10 as well. I love it.
That thing looks better than the classic skins. Uh, Firehawk! Um, I like this. This is a reference to, um, I think Crash 2? Crash 3? Or somewhere around there? Like, it's been in the Crash games before, I'm sure. Um, and if you saw my, um, review, rating the skins video, um, I did say I don't like Tiny's, uh, general skin, but I do think this fits very well with, uh, that skin, this card here. Um, I think that's the one time I'll ever use that skin, just to, like, put it with this card here. I think it's cool. I think it's a 7 out of 10. Nothing too bad, nothing too special, though, but it's still pretty good. Still good to me. And that's officially it. Alright, so, um, the best ones are obviously the classic one and, uh, the retro one. Still very nice basic. I love it. Uh, Team Cortex is, I think, the only 10 out of 10 I ever given it. Like, out of all the cards that's like, this is the only 10 out of 10 card. I love this card so much. It's, it's the best. Obviously the best. Team Oxide, really good. Love that one. Love the Hovercraft. Uh, can't play Oxide without this thing, in my opinion. Uh, Detonator, love it very much. Play Pinstripe on that, as well as uh, with other cards, but this is like one of the main ones. Um, the Nuke, where is the Nuke? Nuke, very good. Love the design of it. Look at the back. Look at the front. It's badass. It's about to rip you apart. The uh, Velo Chopper. Great skin. Only card I use for Velo. And, um... Just, it looks great. It looks very great. And, um, that's pretty much it. Those are all, like, the 9 out of... 9 out of 10s and 10 out of 10 cards, really. Um, Skull Rider is still very good, and Phantom's still really good. Definitely be using those. Um... Other than that, uh, the others are like maybe, and the, and like the few, like two of them are like no, no, thank you. Like uh, this, this I think is really not that great, and I do think this is the worst one. Look how freaky that is, my god! Don't worry, I'm not gonna put a close up on it. It's too um, painful in the eyes. But uh, thank you guys for watching. Uh, get ready for more videos to come, whatever that is. Um, I won't be reviewing the wheels, though, or the paint jobs and stickers. They're way too many. Um, I mean, wheels are kind of important to me, but, like, um, I usually go with the classic ones. Uh, it depends on what car I'm using. But, um, thank you guys for watching. Uh, see you guys next time in the next video, whatever that is. Uh, take care, and let's run wild. Bye.